I'm going to refill this uh, fountain pen cartridge. It's empty, and uh, I don't have a bottle, but you can do this from a bottle as well. So I did just purchase other cartridges. This is just an old one. I'm getting this. Uh, it's called Mirang, Mirang, whatever. This is black permanent ink. Uh, these cartridges are sealed with a small tiny ball. When it's empty, you can actually hear that ball. So we need to puncture the cartridge, uh, toss the ball uh, in order to just... So um, because this, sometimes you have a cartridge that's specific for your pen. I think uh, bigger brands uh, may have a spe specific cartridge that is not the same when you purchased aftermarket cartridges. So that's why you want to keep the original cartridge, never discard it. And um, you just want to refill it from a bottle or from another cartridge. Now, I got this syringe from, I think, AliExpress. I will go to put this link in the comment section. And now I'm going to just Instead of, obviously you can just puncture the cartridge open, but sometimes if it's not the right size, sometimes you just feel like you are forcing too much. So what I want to do instead is just use a tiny screwdriver, like Chinese screwdriver, uh, just the right size that fits in the neck here. And I'm going to keep this, hold this strongly because you have to push it force actually. Keep it really so you don't, uh, don't make a, a spill or it doesn't uh, uh, spit out from there. And you want to only make a small movement, but with force. So don't allow the screwdriver go right to the bottom. Just a small movement, but with force. And uh, keep it really, really tight with your left hand. Well, it depends if you are a lefty. And I'm just going to, again, I'll try to film from you for you, but I would rather keep my hand lower a small movement only so keep your hand see i'm keeping my hand against uh, the other finger keep your hand from moving too much and that's it try not to use a screwdriver that will enlarge the neck here because this portion has to fit tight in your pen so don't uh, make it larger here at the top just push the small tiny ball in there and um, it's so this is just for the ink and I need to refill this other cartridge so let's just try to use the magic syringe it doesn't hurt so it's just bolt uh, but uh, hopefully it's going to work so I need to just depress it let's just uh, do this for you one hand so I need to depress it until it clicks usually it would click yeah, it kind of makes a click. Anyhow, all the way down. So I'm going to insert the needle all the way down to the bottom because what you want to do is really empty this cartridge all the way down. And I'm not going to put pressure downwards, just toss this spring, but I'm not forcing at the bottom because I don't want to uh, block the needle. Oh, you see the needle gets can get stuck on the ball. This is the ball right at the bottom here. But if I toss the needle, it goes lower. I'm not sure if you did see it. So this is the ball at the bottom. Just toss the needle to get right. So let's just, uh, usually I will do it. Otherwise, let's just try to do it for the video. Okay, it did suck a little bit. Uh, yeah, yeah, obviously, oh, oh, look at this. Very, very nice. <laughs> Yeah, that was to be very much expected. It's uh, a little bit of paper towel uh, won't hurt. Okay, so it kind of, so this was the original uh, replacement cartridge, it kind of sucked pretty much a lot of it. I'm not sure how it did spill on my hands and being a non-permanent, I'm going to wash my hands right away, right away. Let's just try to refill. So this is the cartridge that needs to go into the fountain pen. Let's just push the thing back. And before you release it, remove it from the bottle. So you just don't suck back that ink. Let's just try again. Go slowly. 
and then hold and release go slowly because it looks like i do have a spill right here on my table let's try to suck it up you, perhaps you don't see it because the table is black there is a little little spill just saving a little bit is really not not, not a big deal just pump it in and release it good all right so um i did uh, manage to transfer maybe i would say maybe more than two thirds perhaps and the other one third is on my hand but it gives you the idea and uh from this moment on i'll just what you want to do is just insert it i would usually go wash my hands right away but uh, i'm filming so uh, make sure it's inserted and it stays tight it, it it has to be quite difficult to turn that's how the original cartridge meant for your specific font and pen must uh, fit in there if it's loose uh, it may just uh, the, the um, ink may just dry dry over time and uh, yeah and now one uh, last thing is when you refill maybe from another cartridge make sure you empty that cartridge because if you leave uh, ink in there if, if, if in, even if you put it upside uh, uh, standing like this the ink will dry off after a few days so you you just lose that ink and lastly i'm going to wash and rinse this syringe i'm going to just inject distilled water i don't like tap water tap water has residue on it it may clog it at some point so i'm going to wash it uh, right away with uh, rinse it uh, inside out with a distilled water uh, and uh, hopefully this is going to come off my hands as well yes i did review my video and i did a rocky mistake uh, when the cartridge the full cartridge i did insert the needle i press down on the syringe basically that did bubble up the ink so uh, the correct steps are full cartridge to be uh, sucked from press first the needle all the way down insert at the bottom and then slowly release to refill the needle and then just uh, go for the let's say this is the empty cartridge simply just insert and just refill slowly and then remove and release uh, yeah uh, you you did notice the mistake and the mess it did uh, happen because of it uh, i couldn't really uh, wash off my hands very very well now i just want to suggest because i will uh, give the link for this uh, product for this range i want to suggest before you use it with ink before you work with ink just put some distilled water and just try to maybe redo the so the entire operation so needle uh, syringe depressed insert inside the cartridge release to refill remove insert in the new cartridge empty cartridge and just press down in this way is going to practice you will see the jet of uh, the water flowing also will practice you on the stiffness of the spring and uh, will make you more comfortable uh, don't forget uh, you can uh, on this unit just remove the needle itself and just don't forget to empty empty completely the syringe and let it dry like this maybe if you want a test um, with the uh, pen okay so this is the cartridge i just uh, placed on it yeah the camera it's uh, lazy focusing today uh, so uh, this is the new ink and uh, it works nicely okay uh, this one wasn't that expensive we are in canada i got it uh, from uh, staples i think and it's about uh, canadian three four bucks so i guess uk us going to be two three dollars black permanent and each of these cartridges one millimeter milliliter milliliter okay all right thanks so much